Hello, I am back with the very last reveal of my Is It Halloween Yet swap. You guys, the swaps have been so amazing. I have just been blown away at the creativity and the effort and the inspiration that these ladies have shown. Um, I just, I can't even express how much joy it's brought me to open these packages each day and to share them with you and to be inspired. Um, thank you so much to everybody who did participate and thank you to everybody who's been watching and commenting. Um, some really sweet, nice comments that have been um, very, very fun. Um, okay, so I did want to, before I dive into this swap, I did want to share that on my previous swap, um, I was like, or on my reveal video, I'm like, where does this um, spider web go? It actually goes on the back, guys. I totally missed the whole back part of this swap, so I do apologize. Um, it, it came off of here. It was stuck on here on the back, and then I forgot to show this little, well, I didn't forget, I just didn't even see, this little ghosty. Look, it's got a little... Um, spring here on this witch's way and how cute is that so she stamped out this cute little hat and then we she stamped this out and we've got this cute little ghost with the glittered eyes and then one of those little wobbles on the um sign so i totally missed the whole back side of this tag flip so i do apologize for that okay so today we are sharing um, this swap from V. She is buzzing with V, and I will be sure to tag her in this video so that you can head over and follow her and check out all of her inspiration. And it was make two, receive two, and she did make one for me, so I do really appreciate that. So I am going to dive into this. Look how cute. She's got some fun ribbon and some, um, what is this, uh, tool. And then look at this cute little tag here. Super, super fun. So I'm going to just take this off of here and let's dive in and see what she has created. All this fun shred. Look at all that. So festive. <clears throat> and let's see. Oh my gosh. Look how cute. Hold on. There's things. There's little, I don't know if they're part. I think they're confetti. Hopefully they are not pieces that have fallen off. Hold on, let me get all this out of the way so we can take a good look. I think these are just confetti pieces here. Look how stinking cute this is. Oh my gosh. Okay, she's made a loaded bag out of this ghost. Look how fun. She's got this super cute boo banner here. It's all stitched and this like fluorescent orange thread. I love that thread. She's got some sequins stitched down here and some diamond dots. And there's a couple of little bats here. The ghost is stitched all around, including the arms. Absolutely so fun. Look at this little bow up here. Girly, this is so super duper cute. And what a way to think outside the box. I love that. So fun. Okay, so in the front, she has like a pocket here. And in the front, she has included some sequins mix. Look how cute. It says witches. And she stitched through the little words there. And look at that super awesome sequins mix. Perfection right there. And then we have this cute little Halloween pick here. So cute. And I think, let me just make sure I didn't miss anything. Okay, so that just tucks right there in that little pocket. So cute. I love this. I love that there's a little pocket there. That's adorable. Okay. And then here, she's got this thing packed full. Of, I just love this idea. It's so cute. Oh my gosh, look at the back. She stitched all of these bats on the back. And then here's her tag down here at the bottom. So cute. Look at that. How fun. Oh, how fun. I love it. Okay, so let's see what she's got here for us. So first up, oh, I just watched your video on these. Um, so she did a whole video. Uh, if you haven't seen it, go over there and check it out about how she made these tags. And then she did the shrinky jink charms and the um, dangles and all of that. Look how cute. She's got this boo to you and this baker's twine tied around. But yeah, she shows you how to make this whole thing. Um, that is something I have not tried 
and I really do want to do it. It's on my to-do list. I want to make some Shrinky Dink charms. In fact, your video made me think I really need to go order some um, shrink film and or shrink plastic, whatever it's called, and try it out because I think I would just love it. Um, look at this. This is so cute. So it's got like the skeleton. Let me get it close so y'all can see. And it has like two holes in it and there's like a chain going across the skeleton and it has all these beads hanging off of it. This is the cutest thing. So cute. And then look at this cute little ghosty underneath here. So fun. And she stitched these little sequins on there. This is so, so cute, girly. I love that. Yeah, I need to, I really have to do that because I really want to, I want to try it out. I think I would love it. So super, super sweet. And oh my gosh, look how cute. So we've got a little pick here, this little cat. So cute. Got it tucked in there, super fun. And then look at these. Oh my gosh, they're so tiny and cute. Okay, so it says Batty for you. I think she's used the Happy Halloween collection from American Crafts, which you guys know is like one of my all time favorite collections. And she has made these teensy little adorable uh, flag banners. Look at these. Look how cute. I can't get over how tiny and cute these are. She stitched on them. There's two flags on each one. She's got the puffy stickers, these little um, foam stickers here at the top. I think these are um, like the acetate. She's like laminated little confetti inside of there. Oh, and she poked holes. Check this out. She poked holes. I don't know if you'll be able to see. She poked holes in this acetate so that she could thread these through there. That's genius. So good, girly. Love, love, love that. So cute. I'm going to put them right back in there so they don't get messed up. Oh, love those. Okay, and then we have another little pick here. Very fun. And then look at this. She has included a bunch of die cuts. So let's open these up. Let's see what's inside here. Look at this cute little bag topper she's made too. Look at that. Got candy. And we got this cute little cat with a little hat on. Super cute. Okay, and then the die cuts are, we've got a glittered spider web, this cute cat, some bats, lots of glittered bats. You can never have too many of those when you're crafting. There's like a whole bunch there. This cute little pumpkin, I love this little guy. He's so cute. And then we have a skull and crossbones and a spider. And then um, this really fun ghost, I love this ghost too another bat and then let me set these down <clears throat> and then we have the layering piece for this bat check that out so you can layer it up yourself super super fun and then this pretty glittery tombstone very very fun thank you so much for sharing those and then uh, we have these really fun rosettes. So she's got this spider clip up here. Love that. And then um, look at this little bag topper. She stitched like a cross through the boo. So much fun. And then she's made a couple of rosettes for us. So let me see if I can get these out so we can check them out. Oh my gosh. And she even stitched on the rosettes. Look at those. Wow. Those are very fun. Very fun. Lots of layers on there. Lots of stitching. She stitched the actual rosettes. And then here she stitched the word. And she's got it layered up just perfect. So, so fun. Okay. And then, let's see here. She also made these little... Um, bookmarks or I think you can also use them as bag toppers if you want to so again I just love this like X stitching that you've done on everything it's very Halloween I need to remember that because it's really cool looking 
I really like that. Okay, check this out. So she messaged me, but I can't remember if she said these were bag toppers or bookmarks, but I think you could use them for either one. They slip on top of like a piece of paper. So like here, look, I think, did you do a video on these? I might've watched this video and I thought when you were making them, I thought, oh, how cool. Um, those are super fun. Yeah. Look how cute those are. They've just got like a little triangle folded and of course she's decorated up like so super, super cute. The bat and the stitched word. I love that you've put all this baker's twine. So cute. I love these. This makes me want to try these out and try to do them myself. So fun. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love everything girly. You did an amazing job. A perfect way to end uh, this swap. Um, again, thank you to everybody. Thank you um, for all of your inspiration and creativity. And I am going to go swap these out now and send them off to their new homes. And so be watching their channels. Everybody who participated in this swap will be sharing reveals of what they received. And then you can see their reactions. It's the gift that just keeps on giving. So um, again, thank you so much. And I will talk to you guys later. Okay, bye.